these items are all from Rainbow. Because, and I had to think about it, because I went to It's Fashion. You know my It's Fashions. You know I love my It's Fashions. Don't do me like that. You know I love them. Um, so I went there one evening. I got off at 6 o'clock, and I was like, I want to hurry up, hurry up. If you know anything about Atlanta traffic, you can't get from one place to the next door across the street in five minutes in this Atlanta traffic. I went after I got off at 6 o'clock and got and pulled up at It's Fashions at 6.55. They were closing the doors because they closed at 7 that day. So pissed off. So pissed off. But I wasn't tripping because I went down the street to Rainbow. Rainbow closed at like 9. So I was like, awesome. I'll shop at Rainbow today. Um, and Rainbow is a really good... Um, I, I don't like to say the word cheap because that could imply that, the, that it's poor quality or, or that it's bad product. Um, but I'll say inexpensive. And which is what I like to do is inexpensive shopping. Um, mainly because I just don't like paying a lot of money for clothes. And for the second portion is with me losing weight. I'm losing weight so quickly. My sizes are changing. I would rather not invest in a whole wardrobe in one size when I could be uh, a size or two smaller in the next month or two. So um, my clothes are not going to be you don't know, name it Marcus and anything like that because it's just it's no point um so all of these items remaining are going to be from rainbow we will get into the pants first if I can get it together y'all I should have taken this stuff off the off the hangers what I do is when I buy stuff I come and I hang it up on my rack right here if you can see it because I know my next video I just pull what I'm going to review or what I'm going to talk about off the rack um but I should definitely take these off the hangers before I start talking about them this uh, this these are some um khaki cargo pants not a real zipper not buttoned they're drawstring pants and um i like this detailing this crotch detailing i have no idea why i like it but they've got the cargo pockets and then they gather at the bottom and i thought these would be some good um pants that you can dress up dress down you can wear um some athletic shoes with these and a tee and be put together and be cute or you can actually put these with a pair of pumps um and a cute top and dress it up so you will be surprised how you can um style cargo pants or um casual items these are actually branded almost famous i got an extra large if you can see the tag that is a very large tag so that's why I showed it to you um, these were originally $18.99 but they were on sale for $15 um, like I said they're extra large you got them from rainbow I will try to link them down below but I do not think that they are on the site but I will look for you next item same pair in black again um, same brand almost famous size extra large got the crotch detailing going the cargo pocket and the pant leg same pair in black same size same price next two items are denim jeans they are light wash which I get very few of every time I go shopping and get jeans they're typically a dark wash or a medium wash um, I don't I try to stray from light wash and white a whole lot because that could make you look a little larger. It could. Not always. It could. So, um, but this time I got two light wash pair of jeans. These are um, wax jean. And if you haven't heard of wax jean, a lot of people sell wax jean. Um, they sell wax jean at Rainbow. They sell it at um, It's Fashion. They sell them at Ross. Um, and it's a really good jean. And they're always... They're always the stretchy jean. They're not a, a denim fabric. But um, here is the front. They are light wash, distressed, and they come rolled up like a boyfriend jean, but they're actually fairly fitted. Um, not fairly, they're tight. 
I'm just gonna admit they're tight but I bought them like that because I like that fit I like the look I like my jeans to be tight because if they start off loose and they wear through the day then they're gonna fall off you by the evening so I like my jeans to be fitted because by the time I wear them they loosen up and then they get a natural fit um, these are in a size 14 and I paid um, I believe it was $12.99 for these jeans. If it was not $12.99, then it was $15.99. I'll link it. I'll link link it. Like I said, I'll try to link them if they're available on the sites. But if not, I'll definitely list all the details about the jeans, the size, the size, the name, and the um, price all down in the description. You know how I do with all my hauls. Even if I don't leave you the link, I leave you all the descriptions to what I tried on, and you can possibly find it somewhere else um, and compare it if compare it to my body type. If you are my body type or you have a similar build, um, you'll know how wax jeans fit on you. So, that's that. These jeans, same price. Again, I'll have to double check on what the price is. Could have been a $12.99 or $15.99, one of the two. Um, but these are also wax jeans. Ha! I lied to you guys. I lied. I lied so bad, it's not even funny. These jeans are $24.99. Somebody snuck these in on me because I would not have paid full price for these jeans. I wouldn't have. You know me. We're here. You know me. I would not have paid $24.99 for these jeans. So somebody snuck these in on me. These were $24.99 apparently. Size 14, wax jeans. I like these. Um, the reason I like these is they're normal looking distressed jeans. But look at the ends. Oftentimes I find jeans and they're like the previous pair where they're rolled up or they have a tapered hem at the bottom. Um, and I really, really like these because these are untapered as well as long enough. These actually hit my ankle. So if I were to um, wear, if I wanted to dress these up and wear these with a nice pair of pumps, they look like dressier jeans. I don't know because they don't look like a typical hemmed jean. So I found these very, very cute. $24.99. So that's what got me with these. Also size 14. That's that. Two items left. And um, I was feeling a little, a little racy when I saw these items. But they was on clearance. So I was like, hey, I'll get them. This item... I don't even know where I'm gonna wear this guys come on now like a lot of clothes I buy they're cute doesn't mean I always have an idea of how I'm gonna wear this I don't know where I'm wearing this I don't even know if I'm comfortable wearing this out we will see but this is a long sleeve all mesh top back is all mesh the only thing that's not mesh are these flowers that are supposed to cover your boobies um, crop top so it's it's not a long top at all Not a long top. Um, it's in a size extra large. Um, it's by a brand called Blush, but again, I got it from Rainbow. Um, this shirt was on clearance for $7. Please don't let make, make me lie to you. I don't know what the original price was, but I got it on clearance. A lot of times these, even, even the affordable or inexpensive stores have clearance. And you can get so many things on clearance. It's not even funny. You're like... What, 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 what? Grabbing stuff. And then by the time you get up to the register, she's like, oh, that's $582. And you're like, oh. Well, probably should put some stuff back. But um, I got it just because it was $7. And I thought it was super cute. I don't know how I'm going to wear it yet, though. So, but that's that. Extra large. Last item is probably one of my favorites, um, although I'm a little nervous about how to wear it because just a little nervous to wear it just because it's not me, me, like it's not something I would completely wear, ah. but it's this little, it's a bodysuit and it uh, snaps at the bottom and uh, it's all mesh and it's all see-through. 
And the only thing that's covered are these cups that's supposed to cover your boobies. But the boobies don't even, the booby cups don't even look big enough to cover my boobies. But we'll see. We will see. And I definitely have an idea of how to style this. You will see this in a lookbook, guys. You will see it. Um, this is in a size large. It was, a, again, a clearance item. Um, yeah. Seven dollars. So, um, I thought this was super cute with the lacing around the booby part. But yeah, very last item is a pair of shoes. I got these from Goodwill. I probably should have did this with the Goodwill. But these are a pair of Express heels that um, were slightly worn, but not bad. I mean, if I can get it together. Look at the, the backs. Heels don't look bad. Um, yeah. Sanitize them. Doesn't look like anybody's feet's been marinating. You know me and my 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 use shoe feet rule. If, you're, if it doesn't look like your feet's been marinating in them, I might purchase them. So um, these were uh, seven dollars, six or seven dollars from the Goodwill, my local Goodwill. And that's basically it, guys. Again, not wanting this video to be super duper long. So. Um, yeah, I've wrapped it up. I'm also going to do a work um, a fashion haul for work clothing um, or at least a lookbook for work clothing. I'm not going to haul every single thing I buy, guys. So um, I'm going to do a work lookbook as well as a sexy lookbook. You'll see a lot of these items in these past few hauls. Um, so stay tuned for that. Um, always, thank you so much for for watching this video don't forget to like share and subscribe if you did like this video um and this look guys i think this is something that i want to keep i don't know what do you guys think let me know down in the comments um like share and subscribe thumbs up if you liked it um and i appreciate you guys so 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 much and look for me more in the future every thursdays at 7 p.m will be an upload See you guys.